What's up, everybody? What's goody? And I just want to say thank you very much for tuning in to a brand new Pokemon TCG unboxing video that we got for you guys. And this one's special, as you can already tell in the title of the video. It is the brand new meta set for the XY series. And this is the Steam Siege Elite Trainer Box, as you all know. Um, with the XY series, Elite Trainer Boxes have been on the rise, and I certainly love these boxes so much. And they're great for card storage, but without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. Here it is, the Seam Siege box in its turquoise bluish color. The Seam Siege logo on the top with the Pokemon logo right next to it, and of course, Vol. Uh, Volcanion uh, being the main mascot for this set as well. Volcanion is a very, very interesting and very cool Pokemon, and I really, really love it. And it, mainly because of this dual typing features of water and fire. And what's very cool about Seam Siege, and this is a great mascot, is the dual, new dual typing card. So let's go ahead, unbox this box, and let's get to it. Alright, so the packaging that actually covers the Elite Trainer Box comes with a, like, kind of a poster, uh, similar to a poster, which as you can see, we got the Golden Xerneas, we've got the Volcanion, we've got Gardevoir, and the gold, Golden Eveltel. It is a very cool, very amazing artwork that is on here, and these are the four pieces of artwork that are bound to this set of Seam Siege. Next up, with inside the Elite Trainer Box, it wasn't actually inside, it was just uh, on the outside of it, is the Player's Guide. And this is a very cool and unique handbook. Uh, it's got the energy logos on the back, and inside this book itself, let me go ahead and put the knife out of the way. Um, inside the book itself, it comes with basically tool tips for the Steam Seed set, showcasing to you guys all the cards and uh, their abilities and how you can use them in different and specific areas within a TCG battle. And what I really, really love, let me go ahead and get this to focus. It should be focusing to focus. Oh my gosh, it was focusing. Uh, I gotta get this to focus. Come on. Let's go ahead and push that. There we go. Focus is much better now. There's a little bit of a wiggle there, but we got this. Focus, there we go. Now we can read this. Uh, basically, it gives you guys tool tips, trainer tips, and all that stuff. And, of course, the Steam Siege card list, which is what we're all really looking forward to, which is the artwork of every single card. And it's a checklist, so you can go ahead and check out which cards you have, which cards you don't have, which cards you need, all that cool stuff. And it's got the check boxes just above the cards themselves. So it's very cool, and I really use these books every single time thus far with all of my sets. So very cool artwork that goes into these cards and I cannot wait to get into it. And it also shows you the Steam Siege theme decks as well on the back. And we will be uh, unboxing those on our channel as well. Uh, we got tons of cardboard that is uh, around the box, uh, basically keeping the box alive in this ultra mega deep form. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of all this cardboard pieces and showcase you guys what's actually inside this box itself. What comes inside these boxes and even outside, like I just showed you the poster boards as well as the uh, booklets. We've also got card packs and these are card sleeves, uh, 60 card sleeves of course with the Steam Siege logo. Uh, what else do we got in here? We've got the dice with the Steam Siege turquoise blue color theme going on here. We've also got the Let's go ahead and check out what's inside this box next. Let's go actually let's go ahead and take out these. Go ahead and move these packs out of the way really quick. Hold on. Here we go. Here's the basically um you it, they're basically uh files or dividers. There we go. They're dividers so you can use with inside the uh Elite Trainer Box, which you can divide cards from XYs to Megas to Breaks uh, to Commons, Uncommons, and all that stuff. That's extra cardboard. Let me go ahead and remove that. Uh, we've also got the 40 pack of energies of all the energy cards within the game. The Pokemon Trading Card Game Loot Card Code. I do have a giveaway every month in the description box down below, so go ahead and be sure to check that out as well. And of course, the Poison and Band Aid coins for the TCG game itself. And now the box is empty. So I'm going to go ahead and without further ado, go ahead and throw everything back in this box and uh, I'll go ahead and organize it myself when we are done unboxing the packs themselves which are going to be next so I cannot wait to get into that and I know you guys are waiting and super stoked for that as well so let's go ahead and stack that right in front of the breakpoint and fates collide which are the two latest elite trainer boxes and I did unbox those on my channel here are the eight packs themselves for steam siege we've got two of every single 
um, colorway, or theme way, I should say. We've got one Gardevoir, we've got one Volcanion, we've got one uh, Evelta, we've got one Xerneas, and then we've got uh, the second one of each one as well. And we're going to go ahead and open them in the order that I think should give us the great chances uh, towards the end of pulling some decent cards. So we're going to go ahead and start off with the Goldens. We're going to do Xerneas, we've got Eveltel, then we've got Gardevoir, and then the main man himself, which is Volcanion. So hopefully, if my theory is correct, Volcanion being the theme mascot for this set uh, will give us some good pulls, and we're going to do the Golden Legendaries first. I don't think we're going to get two great pulls from Golden Legendaries, but again, TCG loot card code giveaways down below in the description box. Let's go ahead and take these cards outside of the pack, and of course, three from the back, put them in the front, and let's see, first card here, this is my very first Steam Siege set, we've got Nuzleaf. Ooh, let's go ahead and get that focus in there. There we go. We've got Nuzleaf, we've got Gardevoir Spirit Link, so that's a great start. We've got Klefki, we've got Yanma, we've got Chimchar with the gear in his mouth, we've got Bergmite, we've got Cloncher. A lot of these cards have been recently in the anime. Uh, C-Dot. Ooh, here we go, this is what I was talking about, the dual typings. Thunder and Grass with Galvantula, as you guys can see, slipped right through the middle on a diagonal. They dual type that, and then we've got regular Pyroar. Not a great start, but Pyroar is a cool and interesting card, so I will definitely take it. And I was very happy and stoked to get the uh, dual typing Galvantula with the uh, dual typings of Electric and Grass. That is very cool, and this is very unique to this set alone, which is a dual typing trademark. Uh, which is basically a slash in, in between, and it showcases each type for that mod as well. Uh, let's go ahead and pull out that loot card code. Again, giveaway, description box down below. We've got seven more packs to open, so that is 70 more cards. We've got a great chance of getting at least some good, decent pulls out of here. This is the second Xerneas Gold Pack. Lampent. We've got Braviary. We've got Nuzleaf again. We've got Concha again. We've got Nidoran Mail. Very, very amazing artwork there. We got Chimchar again with the gear in his mouth. Nose pass. Very ghastly there. Uh, Litwick. And we've got Larvesta. Okay, here we go. And, oh, okay. Nidoking with the Nidoran male. Uh, that's very cool. The artwork on both that Nidoran and Nidoking are very fantastic. Sadly, no great cards yet. No hollows. Not even a hollow. So hopefully we can get something from the Eveltel gold packs. Eveltel, I, I like more than Xerneas, even though Xerneas is a little bit better in-game console-wise, but uh, TCG-wise, Eveltel is a pretty damn beast, depending on which deck you're playing. So let's get into it, the Eveltel Golden. We've got Skiploom, we've got that Captivating Pokepuff. Wow, okay, it's a long name. we got Clang, we've got Diano, we've got Ponyta, we've got Meryl, we've got Litleo, okay, to go with my, okay, cool, Rufflet, Clink, oh wow, that is such a plain card right there. Very cool though, especially being reversed. And then we've got another regular Weavile. Alright, that is three packs in a row out of eight. We've got five more to go. This is our second Eveltel Gold Pack. Hopefully we can get something out of this because otherwise the legendaries have just been pulling some strings over here. Come on now, I'm breathing, I'm breathing. He opened his pack, dude. I'm struggling to open the pack. I'm shaking my hands over here, son. Shaking my hands. Alright, let's go ahead and Pull out that TCGO loot card code, put it on the top. Again, giveaways down below in the description box. Here we go. We've got the Pokemon Ranger. Looking good over there. I miss those games. If you guys haven't really noticed on my channel, I've been giving you guys updates. Pokemon Ranger games have been added to the Virtual Console, so be sure to check out those videos as well. We've got the Meryl again. Trying to get the focus in, because I don't know, it was getting out of focus there. we got Litleo. we got Rufflet. We've got Fungus. We've got Ponyard. Again, all these cards have been used in the anime recently. Uh, Apalm, and then Kabolian. Uh, it is a regular rare. Uh, just a regular, nothing too fancy, so it kind of sucks. That is both legendaries failing me to the max. Look how many cards we just got, son. All right, let me go ahead and organize these. We got the uncommons of commons, we've got the reverses, and then we've got four. Uh, regulars, so sadly nothing too great. We've got the two Gardevoir packs up next, so let's go ahead. Again, as you guys know, uh, Gardevoir is one of my top six favorite Pokemon in the game, so hopefully Gardevoir can bring out some goodness in here. Haven't seen a uh, split dual type card in a while since that first pack. We got Nuzleaf again. That is okay. We got Braviary again. We've got the Armor Fossil. We've got the Mareep Fletchling. We got Yanma. 
Meryl. Got we get we're doubling up big time now. We got Sneasel. Ooh, Celix's Spirit Link. Oh, that is good. Oh, no way, no way. Celix E. Oh, that is perfect, perfect combo. Finally, we're getting something here. Celix E. X. Now look how, dude, that artwork is fantastic. It, it's it's like it's jumping out of the card, man. It's like a 3D model of the Celix. That is superb. Oh my gosh. Finally, we got a card that I I mean I I couldn't jump too much because I wasn't really expecting it because of how bad these calls were, but. Celix EX. I mean, I'll take it. It's very interesting. Uh, hopefully, we can get some more uh, decent cards out of this Elite Trainer Box of the Seam Siege set. Come on, new card code. Get out of here, son. Uh, giveaway down below. Description box. Let's go ahead and get these 10 cards out of the way. And then we got two more packs left. This is the third to last pack. Again, Gardevoir number two. We've got the Special Charge, Coolio. We got Clang. We got Celix and Spirit Link, non reverse this time. We've got Oshawa, Meryl. Ponyta, we're, getting, we're doubling up all left and right. Oh! I didn't even know! Talon Flame Break. My second break card of all times. Oh my, I, did, I didn't even know. I didn't even expect it at all. I was expecting a reverse. Oh my gosh. It is Talon Flame of all flames, son. The fire typing break card right there. And we got Spirit Tomb regular. Spirit Tomb looks fly. I wish it was hollow. That should be a hollow card because of how cool it looks. I Again, I, they're just coming at me when I don't expect them. We got the last two Volcanian packs of the Seam Siege set. We've got two great, actually two amazing cards. We got a break and as well as the Celix EX, which is very, very cool. We got two more packs. These are the Volcanian packs, mascot of the Seam Siege set, so hopefully they're good. Let's go ahead and open these ones. We got Rabidash. Didn't get that yet, I don't believe. We got Ninja Boy, don't have that. Uh, okay, we're starting up great here. Uh, Hoppip. We got Litwick, Meowth, Ponyta. All right, we double them back up. Oh, we got Joltik. All right, to go with my other reverse, my very first one. And then we've got a regular Samurott, sadly. Got one more pack. Hopefully we can pull something decent. Volcanion, please don't let me down here, son. I've been giving you props for, for months now. Now that you've been in a movie, you've got your own set to yourself. You've got the coolest dual typings of all times. Come on, son, bring it to me. Let's do this. Last pack of all times for the same siege shot. No, I'm joking. Last pack for the uh, Elite Trainer Box. We got Duwat to go with that. Gardevoir Spirit Link. Oshawa. Okay, we're going. We're on fire here. Ponyard. Ponyta. We got Clink. We've got Mantine. Oh, come on. Reverse Mantine. Oh, that, is that a sign or is that a sign? Come on. Last card's going to be fly. Let's do this. Come on. Lit card. Lit. 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 Oh, no. no. Oh, oh. Uh. It is hollow. It's a Hydreigon. Really cool card. Dragon type. It's really rare that you see dragon type cards. So, I mean, it wasn't the worst trainer box of all times, but I mean, look how many uncommons and commons we got. That's a huge stack. We're going to go ahead and recap over here really quickly. We've got our reverses over here. We've got reverse Mantine. We've got reverse Joltik. Uh, reverse Steelix Spirit Link, Reverse Apom, Reverse Clink, Reverse Larvesta, really cool, and the Ultra Mega Reverse Calvantula with the dual typing. That is a really cool reverse card right there, and I'm really happy to have actually got at least one during the Apex that we opened. Here's all of our regulars. Sadly, we got quite a few. Uh, regular Samurai, Regular Spiritomb, Regular Cabalion, Regular Weavile, Regular Needle King with a very great artwork and let regular Pyro with really cool artwork as well. So at least we got some cool artwork regulars over here. We got the just what we just pulled, the hollow hydrogon uh, dragon type. So I don't I'm not mad about that either because it's very cool. Uh very amazing card and a very amazing pull, which is the Celix EX HP one eighty Wild Edge Iron Tail. Very great artwork from that. And then of course my second great card, uh Talon Flame. Very cool Pokemon from the XY series with the Flare Bits ability, and wow, that damage, man. 150 damage. Super soaked on that. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Did you guys pull any interesting cards? Again, the TCGO loot card codes, all of these will be given away down below in the description box. Go ahead and check it out. Social media, sponsorships, all that cool stuff is down below. Donations link as well. Leave a comment if you have any questions. What was your best pull from Steam Siege thus far? Again, thank you very much for tuning in, everybody. For the one Itachi is out.